Welcome all you YouTube lovers and Android lovers. Today I have a special YouTube tutorial for you guys. Today I will be showing you guys how to root your HTC 3D and your HTC Sensation. I know you guys love it when we say root, right? Because then you get to have control over everything. Everything. Anyways. So, back to what I was saying. This um, root permanent root has been brought to you by unrevoked and alpha rev it's pre um it's by the revolutionary developer preview group so uh yeah they really actually came through today um I should say yesterday cuz this was a day late but it came out yesterday so yeah you guys can go out and start rooting your phones. I will show you this little tutorial on how to do it. I'm not going to actually go step by step, but I'm going to go close to step by step because I have already rooted my phone. So it's like no sense of like rerouting it again. Plus, I'm using my, uh, my camera for the webcam to make a little bit better clarity. Anyways, so back to what I was saying. Let's get into this thing. Um, this page right here is. Uh, where all, all the magic happens pretty much um, before you get all this stuff started make sure you guys have your PC drivers installed beforehand so that you guys can uh, get this thing going make sure that your sync HTC sync is disabled or turned off or uninstalled or however you want to do it you go down here it basically will show up download uh, Linux or Windows I chose Windows, I hit Windows, and then it'll download it. Then it'll ask for a beta, it'll say beta key, and then you type in, hit Windows or Linux, your phone type, which mine was HTC Sensation, my um, HBoot version. Basically, if you don't want it, if you don't know what it is, um, unplug your phone from the USB, take out your battery, and then um, uh, put it back in there. Hold your power down, your volume down button, and your power button at the same time. It'll boot you into fast boot. There, it'll show you. It should say pyramid or whatever it is, and it should say S on above that, and it should say like 1.17 or whatever, whatever model these ones are that it shows here. That's what it, you have to choose from. Um, then after that, um, well, while you're at it, while you have your battery out. Um, type down your serial number right here, so then uh, you can get the beta key. Then you just hit generate, and then it'll show up here in green with the, the beta key. Make sure you type it in, or when you do use it, when you have to type it in, type it in exactly as, as it is. If it has a lowercase, use a lowercase. If it's uppercase, it's uppercase. Um, therefore, after you download it and you extract the zip file onto like your C drive somewhere. Um, I put mine under C drive under Android under HTC, and then uh, this is what you'll have. Then you just double click on the re uh, revolutionary. It'll pop up the little command prop. Uh, it should say waiting for device, and then after that it should um, it'll say uh, waiting for device. And then it'll say ask for the beta key. That beta key is where I was talking about before. You use that key type and exactly it is. Hit enter. It'll automatically start going through. What it'll do is reboot your phone back into fast boot. If your phone's already booted, in, booted into regular mode. Boot it into fast boot. It'll reboot it like four times. The third time when it reboots, it'll automatically have S off on there. Which is a good thing. So, then it'll reboot it one more time for a good old sake. And then after that, um, make sure that you have, um, it'll ask that you put um, CWM, which is Clockwork Manager. Hit Y for yes and install it so that it'll be installed so you don't have to worry about installing that later. Then after that, go um, hit Recovery on your phone. And then after that, you would want to uh, back up your whole entire phone. Just uh, be backed up, just in case if you rooted or I mean not rooted, just in case if you did something wrong, as far as your um like installing a new ROM or something or installing something or doing something to it, you have your backup so you can go back to it later. Um, there's also another file that I need you guys to put on your SD card. 
to before you get all started. It's a uh, another file. Put that on the root of your SD. So when you actually go into recovery, um, you guys can hit install. Um, you can install this file onto there, so you'll have permanent root access. Um, you want to put this on the root of your SD card after you get into recovery. You want to flash this file right here. After you do that and reboot into normally, you will have a permanently rooted. Uh, you have a permanent rooted HCC in the story. So good to go. So yeah. Uh, if you guys have any more questions, if you want a more a little bit more of a detail uh, progress, I can do something for you guys. Um, comments or questions below. I have done this already. It has worked. My S uh, my S is off, and my phone is rooted. So uh, you guys um, take care and enjoy this nice little uh, rooting process.